and welcome back to another video. I am really excited for today's video because I'm going to be doing a follow-up to my previous Levi's try on haul video that I did recently. If you haven't watched it, you can go ahead and click up here. In that video, I tried on a pair of Levi's ribcage jeans for the first time and I just completely fell in love with them. So for today's video, I thought I would do a complete review of the ribcage jeans in different styles and in different washes. And I'm also going to be showing you guys how I style them. I'm going to be showing you guys the jeans from my favorite to my least favorite. Overall, I really liked all of these jeans. It's just I really liked some styles a lot more than others. So yeah, let's just get into the video and we are going to start off with the straight ankle corduroy pants. Okay, so these are the corduroy pants. I got these in my regular size, 27. I basically got all of the pants in a 27 except for one. These were my least favorite of the bunch um, just because I didn't really like the corduroy too much. I think the color is really nice, the fit is really nice. Um, I think for all of these jeans, like the fit is really, really great. That's just because like that's how the ribcage jeans tend to fit. They all fit me very well. Um, these are very comfortable. They're more of like a lightweight material, so they're really comfortable to wear. I just, I think I would just prefer these a lot more if they were just like the same color, but just in a denim. I think these would be perfect. I also kind of found that with all of these jeans, like with the straight ankle style, that they kind of slightly flare out a little bit at the bottom. Maybe you guys can see it in the try on portion, but I don't know, for me, they kind of flare out a tiny little bit, which isn't bad, but it's just like something to notice. Like these are not a like tapered style, so you're not going to get that like super slim fit. They do kind of flare out. Um, maybe that's just me. I don't know. but. Still, I think I really like all of these jeans. I think they still look super flattering. But with these, I really love the color. I just wish that they were denim and just not corduroy. I would give these a three stars. Okay, so next we have another straight ankle jeans. These are black and these are kind of ripped. You can't see it right now, but in the try on clip, you'll be able to see, but they are ripped at the knees, just like a small little slit at the knees. And they're also kind of cut off at the bottom so they don't have a hem. Um, these I think flare out the most, even though again, they are a straight ankle. They do have a slight bit of flare. These feel a lot more cinched in than the corduroy pants that I showed first, um, just because they are a slightly more stiff denim. So they do kind of suck you in a little bit more. Um, with these, I don't really love the wash of them. They kind of look like a faded black um, or like a washed out black um, jeans and I don't really like that. I usually like my black jeans to be very, very dark. Otherwise, I actually really do like these pants. Um, the fit is perfect and these are definitely true to size. But yeah, I just didn't really like the wash too much so that's why I would give them a 3.5 stars. Okay, so next we have the bootcut jeans. I didn't think I was going to like these that much, but when I tried them on, I ended up really, really liking the style of these. These are a boot cut, but I like how they almost look like a flare, um, like a flared jean. I was actually looking to get a flared ribcage jean specifically, but I couldn't find any in my size. So I just got these instead and I ended up just really liking them. These are also pretty long. I got these in a 33 inch inseam. So I would probably only wear these with heels. Um, they do make your legs look pretty long, so that's why I really like them. I think the wash of these is like really nice. It's just like a nice dark denim. They are kind of like the same stiffness as like the previous jeans that I tried on. Um, not uncomfortable at all, but they do cinch you in. I think that these are just like a really nice pair of denim. So that's why I give them a four stars. Okay, the next pairs of pants that I'm going to show you, these are my favorites out of all of the ones that I tried on. And I'm going to show you guys exactly why I really like them. So if you're going to get any ribcage jeans, I would definitely suggest getting a pair of these. Okay, so let's start off with the crop jeans in a light wash. 
So these are the ribcage crop jeans in a kind of lighter wash. This denim feels really, really soft. I think out of all of the jeans, this was probably like the softest denim. So it's like really, really comfortable to wear. It's kind of like a more lightweight denim. It's kind of washed in, like kind of like a worn in feel to it. I think these are just like perfect. Like the wash is perfect. The style is perfect. They're just like such a classic pair of jeans. But since it's more of like a softer, more worn in denim, they're not as stiff. So they don't cinch you in as much at the waist. These I got in a 27 and they kind of have a little bit of room um, in the waist. So I do think I could have probably sized down in these if I did want like a more snug fit, but I still think that they fit really well. I think they're just supposed to be like a more like casual fit. But overall, I really, really love these. I think these are like a must have piece to add to your denim collection. They're just like super easy to throw on, very comfortable. I think these are just an amazing pair of jeans, so I give them a 4.8 stars. Okay, so next we have another pair of straight ankle jeans. These are just like in a slightly darker wash. I really, really love these jeans as well. So I would say that these pants have like the most straight fit out of all of the jeans. Like I said, the other jeans kind of flare out a little bit, like just a tiny bit. But these were, I think, like the most straight fit out of all of them. The denim is probably like the most stiff out of all of the pants as well. I would just say like a tiny bit uncomfortable. It's not bad at all, but it is kind of noticeable when you first put them on. After a while, like you don't really notice, but I guess if you are sensitive to fabrics, I would just be like a little bit cautious about these just because I think they are like the most stiff denim out of all of the jeans. But I think over time with some washes, I think you could really break these in. That being said, I really love these as well for their classic style. I love the wash of them, like the dark wash. Um, they kind of give me like a vintage feel, like a vintage dark wash denim. They feel very, very sturdy. So they do cinch you in at the waist pretty nicely. And overall, I think these are a solid pair of jeans. I would say that these are true to size. I got these in my size 27. And I think overall, like they're amazing. These are the type of jeans that everybody needs to have in their closet. I would also give these a 4.8 stars. Okay, and last but not least, I'm going to show you guys my favorite pair of rib cage jeans that I tried on. These are the black rib cage jeans in a wide leg style. These are just absolutely amazing. First of all, these are very wide jeans. Well, at least for me, because I don't wear a lot of wide jeans. So when I saw these in person and was putting them on for the first time, I thought they looked ridiculous because there was just so much fabric. And they're also really long. I usually don't go past a 32 or 33 inseam in jeans. And these are a 34, so they're just really long on me. But when I put them on, they just looked so good. And I think they just work so well. Because they are so long, I think I would only feel comfortable wearing these with heels, just like the other bootcut jeans. But let me tell you, they make your legs look so, so long. I think that's another reason why I like these so much and why these are my favorite. I was looking for the same style in white, but it was just sold out everywhere. So I just went with the black instead and I really, really like these. Also, these are the only pants that I didn't get in my normal size, a size 27. I actually got these in a size 26 because that was the only one that they had left. And I just knew I had to have these jeans. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna make it fit. And they actually do fit pretty well, even though they're a 26, they're like a size smaller than I would normally wear. Um, they are pretty tight just because like the denim really does cinch you in. So these are a little bit tight for me but I think these still work and I could still wear them pretty comfortably. Also, these are the only pair of ribcage jeans that don't have the button fly. These actually have a zipper, like a regular zipper fly instead. Um, so yeah, that's just something to note. But overall, I think these are amazing. I think these can really like elevate your look. They make you look really tall and they're just really comfortable. So yeah, I would give these a six stars. As you guys can probably tell, I really do love the ribcage jeans. I think no matter the wash, the color, or the fit, 
I think they are super, super flattering. I do still want to try to find a rib cage like flare jeans. I want to see how they kind of compare to the wide leg fit. I'm also keeping an eye out for the wide leg rib cage in a white denim. I would absolutely love to style those jeans. But yeah, that's it for today's try on and review. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.